December 12th today. You can see we're building up some banks here a little bit. Yesterday was a snow day, but didn't turn into the storm they thought, so kids stayed home from school for nothing, it looks like. Um, I've got all my hutches full now. And uh, I think there's a cow going to calve soon. We just keep having heifers. <laughs> Heifer after heifer after heifer. Which is nice. I don't know where my toboggan is. Huh. What's doing, Cavi? There we go. Okay. Let's dry in there. Grab this bottle. How are you doing, guys? I like this one. She's from Fiesta. Nice white cabbie. <laughs> yeah. I don't know where the toboggan is. That's weird. Usually out here, alongside the calves. Huh. There goes Wilma. Doesn't she know it's storming out? It is not nice out. Wow. Beautiful though. Nice big flakes. <laughs> So it's plus three today and this is what it looks like when it gets mild after it's been really cold. It starts to rain in the barn because of condensation. So we have the fans on, we open the curtains and uh, yeah, hopefully it'll dry up soon. I'm just out here because this is my cell count wasn't doing it the what's well, it called the regent and isn't working or something for testing the milk so hasn't worked since last night we got an alarm this morning so I'm gonna see what I can find what's wrong with it could be just plugged you can see the level it is getting down but it's plenty above there there is some bubbles it looks like in this so I might take that apart and there's moisture in here which I don't like to see Ooh, okay this is my toolkit that comes with the robot and they give us an assortment of parts, spare parts and tools. Some of these tools are my own, like the vice grips and, and stuff and these, but yeah, got some cool stuff in here. So I'm going to take this part, see what I can do with it. beige bubbles in it that look like build up or something.
time. I had it plugged solid one time. So I'm going to call the hotline and I have my earbuds this time so that will help me be able to talk to them and uh, work on this at the same time. So I'm going to put that call in. Oh. Hi, how are you? to stop by errors. Zero. Oh. Milk probe zero. Regent probe 14. Empty milk probe 142. Okay. Well, the empty milk probe value was 142, sorry. Now it's zero. Yeah. And the empty, the empty regent probe average is 104. Test routines, okay. It has a question marks in the status clearing. Oh, I think I went somewhere I shouldn't. Okay, hold on here. It's, yep, yep. Okay, here we go. Sorry, I had the wrong thing. All right, so run the prime regent line. Seated. All right. Okay. 
It's been really cold in the barn lately. Would that have any effect on it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, everything else would be frozen too, so <laughs> I guess. <laughs> yeah, it said succeeded. Sure. Yeah, I see it. Stuff's moving through it and the pump is running. So, huh. draining out the bottom too so you can see that okay it's done or no milk probe failure failed yeah I guess we might as well do that while we're at it um Okay, so go to test and move the arm, right? Okay. And then put the bars in. Them in and then oh sure sounds like a plan good idea I'll give it a spray okay all right okay did that so now what? Go to tasks. Yep, cup offsets and bead portion scale. So cup offsets. Okay, got it. All right. So I'm in scan position already, right? So I just. So. They all say one, 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 one at the end on the last row. Okay, minus one, minus one, zero, minus one. I'll try again, scan again. Okay. Okay. It's doing its thing over there. You can see it on the bars. Cool. All right, it says it's done saying the same numbers again but it's still saying next cup now is right front. Oh. Okay, so just save calculated values then. 
but it's pretty good. All right, so I can take the bars out now and put it back to home. Easy to get out. <laughs> okay. All right, back to home. And then I'll put it back to play, I guess. We're done, right? Okay, thank you. All right, well, I'll wait for someone to come fix the my cell count reagent then. I'll, should I put that lid back on because I have it off? Because who knows when it'll, they'll come. Okay. Thanks. All right, bye-bye. Okay. So, the milk probe is broken, they're going to send someone out to fix it. And he's saying that when I did the bar scan, as long as it's less than three, and it was minus one and zero, if it gets up to three or five on any of those seats, then they need to someone to come out and adjust the uh, settings. So, yeah. So now we wait till someone comes to fix it. And not good because it really, really is nice. You get used to knowing where your cows are at with their infections, with the science and stuff. Those counts really help us determine what milk goes in the tank and keeps our milk clean. So hopefully they come soon. Grand River Robotics came back two days later and they put a new lid on here and they fixed the milk probe so now we know we are getting all our milk tested the way we're supposed to be and looks like we'll have a sealed compartment again so that's good. I don't know if you can see it pulsing in there or not. Yeah, pretty cool thing to have. Thanks for watching.